led blindfolded and paraded into court. Four men Moscow claims are responsible for the worst act of terrorism in Russia in 20 years. The accused told the court they were from the Central Asian nation of Tajikistan. All the suspects had visible bruising. One was in a wheelchair and appeared non-responsive. New footage has emerged of the massacre at the hall in Moscow. Concert goers took cover behind pillars. As gunmen opened fire a few metres away. The chaos and terror continued into the auditorium before the building was set on fire. An offshoot of the Islamic State group ISIS-K claimed responsibility. The terrorist group has been threatening Russia since it backed the leadership in Syria. Russia has been involved in the fight against ISIS in the Middle East um, and more recently, it had established ties with the Taliban, which is ISK's number one enemy. Russia claims the suspects were fleeing to Ukraine. No, there is no whatsoever any evidence. And in fact, what we know to be the case is that ISIS-K is actually, um, by all accounts, responsible. Russians queued outside the concert hall to pay tribute on a national day of mourning. It was a big shot because I live nearby and I saw it from my windows. It's, uh, it's horrific. Bring back the death penalty, this man says, at least for terrorists. President Putin lit a candle for the victims at his estate. As the country prays, there'll be no more attacks. Steve Kinane, ABC News.